right, Matrix and Road Show. Well, we're going to talk about Nicki Minaj because, well, she got busted. And today, law-abiding citizens in America are, well, for lack of a better way of putting it, dragging her ass in the Brittany Griner land. I've got J.R. Ewing with me for this video. And uh, we're going to talk about this. There's a there's, um, video out right now of her getting arrested, and we'll just bump over and take a look at it because... Uh, well, it looks, I mean, you would think uh, something was really going down here. Now, you may be thinking Amsterdam, what the hell, leads, weed is legal, right? Uh, well, it is, except they do still have laws about having weed in certain places. And this was in and around the airport, airport security, et cetera, et cetera. And, uh... I would be a hypocrite if I didn't call her out on this because, well, I crushed Brittany Griner in the dirt. Now, question is, does Biden have a, uh, do we have a arms dealer <laughs> that we can trade for Mick, Nicki Minaj? I'm just wondering. I'm asking for a friend. <laughs> Brittany Griner wants to know, hey, better yet, let's trade Brittany Griner for Nicki Minaj. Uh, wait, even better. Keep both of them. <laughs> we'll trade you Brittany Griner, and we don't even need anybody in return. Just take her, okay? Just take her. So, Colin Rugg put this up, and there's going to be people that are like, what's your deal with weed? I, I got no problems with the weed smoking. The problem is you still got to follow the laws of the land if you wish to do so. I mean, that's still a thing, you know? I mean... It, what I used to say on Griner videos is it doesn't matter what our laws are. It's what the other country's laws are. Uh, they don't give a rip about our laws. I mean, they just don't. Be smarter when you're traveling overseas or out of, out of the country. So this is where we're at. Rapper Nicki Minaj arrested in Amsterdam for alleged drug possession. The incident was filmed on live stream. She was on a live stream when this happened. Uh, she got filmed by Minaj herself. The rapper was told that all of her luggage needed to be offloaded from the plane and searched. Quote, they took my luggage, and when I asked where it is, they said it's on a plane. It couldn't have been. I just pulled up, she said. This is Amsterdam, by the way, where weed is legal. Now they say they found weed, and that other group of people have to come here to weigh the pre-rolls. Keep in mind, they took my bags without consent. My security, why, why would they have to ask you? My security has already advised them those pre-rolls belong to him. Oh, yeah, and the pilot wants me to take my IG da post down. So the pilot wants her to take the Instagram post down. This has went viral, by the way. 4.6 million views. Let's watch it. Tell me again. The police officer told me, we have to offload all the luggage okay. and to search everything of okay. your luggage. I'm so sorry to, to say that. But isn't that what you planned on doing from the get-go? Why didn't you guys search it before it went on the plane? Uh, they did a, just a random a quick check, but now they want to open Why? it. Why? First of all, because you filmed him and he was like... Because I filmed him? Where am I going? Yeah. For what? For what? Why, why am I going here? Hello. Yeah. Your Honor, arrest. I'm the police officer. I'm the deputy of the public prosecutor. Uh, we will bring you to the police station. What? Yes. For what? You can go uh, because you are uh, carrying drugs. I'm not carrying drugs. Okay, but it's not a question here. Uh, I think it's. I'm not smart carrying to go drugs. Inside. Number one, when I came here. Yeah. My the okay, back. You can go inside. No, I'm not going in there. I need a lawyer present. You will get a lawyer. It's no, I problem. need a lawyer present now. Okay, please. Where am I going? I have no idea where you I'm going. You have to go to the police station. What? What? How? What address is that? It's five minutes away. Uh, it's they, five they minutes. What's yes. What's the address of the police precinct? When you uh, will catch your next show, we have to do it very fast, and we will help with. Well, you're talking about my show? Yes. What about it? Uh, yeah. We talk. He said they will help to try to get you there. 
they'll help to try to get me to my yes. show. So you How? Can very uh, to do it as soon as possible. But what, can... what am I doing? What am I doing? I you never gave anyone. My, I never. Oh, I'm. Oh, so I'm under arrest. Yes. But yes. under arrest for what? Okay. Stop filming now. I'm under arrest for what? Okay. Do you Stop know what happened now. when I came you here? You have to go inside. Huh? What you said? Can you please stop filming? It's just step in the car for us? No, I need a lawyer. But I, because I don't know where I'm going. You will get a lawyer at the office. You can contact the lawyer. But if you just step in the car, then we, it will go as fast as possible. And who's going in the in this in this vehicle? So please step. You will go car. with. Okay, so that's the video. Now, my, a couple of my questions would be, is it the smartest move to not comply in another country? Just wondering. Uh, I mean, I'm just pointing this out. So, as you can imagine, a lot of proud Americans weighed in on this. Again, I don't think the issue was so much the weed as it was, hey, don't violate laws in other countries. Yes, weed is technically legal. But there's certain places you can't you can't take it, like this the the redheaded libertarian. Weed is legal in Amsterdam, but you still can't fly with it. It does say which is gay and retarded. Uh, okay, I, I mean I see your I see your point. Yeah, Juanita Broderick, she has everything she could possibly want, and then takes drugs into a foreign country. These people think they are so entitled. And I guess these people are as in celebrities. My goodness, just shaking my head, truly. The great Gunther Eagleman, do the crime and do the time. Peace out, Nikki. <laughs> That's really good. Oh, she made quite the mistake. She didn't need to bring it into the country. They have it there. Sometimes she ain't right in the head. Maybe Biden will get... Her released if she promises to vote for him. Isn't that what Griner did? Just wondering. Oh, man, that's crazy. That's crazy. Amsterdam has streets with all sorts of legal drugs and legal prostitution just lined up. So what was she arrested for? Again, I don't guess you can take it into different areas. You know, uh, I guess the, the airport, airplane, that's a big no-no, right? Uh, so... Uh, here we go. Why would you bring drugs into a foreign country? You would think celebrities would have not learned to bring drugs into another country after Brittany Griner was arrested and locked in a Russian prison for 10 months for having weed. Uh, it's going to be interesting. Are you going to end up in the gulag? Just wondering. Inquiring minds want to know. Nicki Minaj broke the law and should be prosecuted. She likely won't face any real consequences because she's a celebrity. That's celebrity privilege. Uh, we know how this goes. Also, does Minaj not have enough privilege that she needs to transport drugs internationally? I wondered about that myself. Uh, USMC Lady Vet. I'm so old, I remember the Beatles were arrested in Japan for having marijuana. Wow, you learn something all the time. You really do. Seriously. Uh, weed on the plane is not the same as legal weed in an Amsterdam coffee shop. There are still rules. <laughs> More Brittany Griner shade. Is there a Dutch arms dealer that Biden can prisoner swap for Nicki Minaj? <laughs> That's really good. That's really good. I need a lawyer. You're not an American anymore. Uh, laugh out loud. Yeah. I, I mean, seriously. People need to realize the authorities in other countries are not like the United States. They take their laws seriously. Yeah. I mean... Look, you see it all the time here in Texas. People coming out of Colorado, and we all know how Colorado is. Well, guess what? In Texas, the, lead, the weed is still illegal. Yeah, it's illegal, and they wait and will bust you when you come across. So if you come across in an old beat-up Volkswagen van and there's smoke pouring out of it, mm, Highway Patrol probably going to get your ass in Texas. Just saying. Exchange, exchange Brittany Griner for Nikki. Uh, seriously, uh, can we can we do that trade? Do we have three merchants of death to trade? Brittany Griner is taking some real shrapnel. Uh, she will soon realize the same thing. The moment you realize America wasn't bad after all. <laughs> Brittany Griner is taking mad shit in this. This is great. That's a, 
unexpected pleasantry that was added to this video I did not see coming at all was the uh, uh, Brittany Griner thing. The, the black privilege is only good in America, darling. You have to act like the rest of the world does in other places. I'm sorry, but your race card has been declined. Do you have another form of argument? Question mark. Of course not. I mean, uh, seriously, no. No. No reason to leave America these days. I mean, seriously. Uh, oh, Nicki Minaj to the pilot. Somebody please tell him who the F I is. Mm, that's interesting. Interesting uh, intellect indeed, I would say. Yep. I bet if she gets arrested, Biden will get her out. Yeah. Yeah. Seriously. Oops. The br black privilege card didn't work out outside of the U.S. Oh, no. So that's where we'll leave it. But you can see. Uh oh. It wasn't me. Interesting. Uh, interesting. That's going to leave Nikki alone. Okay. Uh, so, and, and again, it's not so much the weed as it is you're in another country and it's like do these people have nobody that can guide them towards the things to do and not do I mean you would think common sense would kick in but uh, uh, common sense is not a strong suit for a lot of people so there's that wow wow so tell me in the comment section should we trade Brittany Griner for Nicki Minaj. Should we pay Amsterdam to take Brittany Griner and keep Nicki Minaj? We'll trade you Brittany Griner if you won't send back Nicki Minaj. <laughs> oh, man. Oh, great. Peace. I'm out. Till next time.